Fox 29's Brad Satton is live in Madigan tonight. Brad. Lucy, the FBI at this point is not confirming the existence of this video, but it reportedly shows Shane Montgomery coming out of Kildare's Irish Pub just across the street here in Maniunk, walking across the street, heading down this sidewalk here where he was caught on video. First, as you see there by that video camera on the side of this building here at Christie's Nail Salon. These angles are what the video cameras at Christie's Nail Salon show. The new report surfacing says that one camera shows the sidewalk across the street from Kildare's, where it's believed Shane Montgomery left the bar and then turned the corner and was captured on a rear camera approaching the Schuylkill River and wasn't seen again. So many questions from family and friends. It is a mystery. and. It's, it's been going on too long now. It's a full two weeks now, and the police department's Marine unit fighting the cold and wind this morning. We're back at it once again, following up on the latest tip, dredging along the banks of the Schuylkill River, but once again turning up nothing. And no better luck as investigators continued the search from land. Admitting they are desperate, police say there's been no trace of 21-year-old Shane Montgomery since he was last seen early Thanksgiving morning, leaving Kildare's Irish pub. These women have been searching for him every single day. We're trying to do our best to find this kid. This, this stuff does not happen in Maniunk and Roxburgh. It's such a tight-knit community that if he's over crossing that bar, how can, he, how can he go down Main Street and not one person see him? Despite posters with his picture plastered even in neighboring counties, volunteer searches and crews on both land and in the air, Shane remains missing. On the Help Find Shane Montgomery Facebook page, his family announced the reward for information that leads to him now stands at $65,000, saying it just takes one brave person to come forward with information, even seemingly inconsequential, to bring Shane home. It's been 14 agonizing days. Despite the rain and the cold, his friends and family are still here trying to make sense of it all. If it could happen to him, it happened to anybody, so everybody just wants answers at this point. Now back to this reported video of him. The owner, Christy, says that several videos were indeed taken from her. She is not sure exactly what's on the video, but again, a law enforcement reportedly has this video at this point, and we are hearing they're going to be back on the water again tomorrow. Ian?